Hello, my name is David Jones, and this is my presentation pitch idea for the Capstone Project. My idea is a 2D side-scroller puzzle game where the player must navigate through a level by only touching the platform of the same color as the player. These platforms will include the ceiling, the floor, the walls, or really anything that the player touches other than free falling through the air. Throughout the level, the player must avoid certain colored platforms to make it to the finish point and advance to the next level. But the player can reach a collectible somewhere in the level where the collectible will actually change the color of the player and allow them to use previously unusable platforms. The goal of the game is simple. To make it through the level only touching the same color platforms as the player and reach the door at the end where the player can advance to the next level. The ultimate goal of the game is to find a way to become the multicolored player. The multicolored player can touch multiple platforms of different colors without worrying about destroying itself. The antagonizing force is simple, to not touch platforms of a different color than the player. The player can run, jump, and in the instance of jumping onto a wall, can jump again off that wall in the opposite direction and so forth if surrounded by walls. This gives the player the ability to jump off of multiple walls to reach a higher platform that previously was believed to be unreachable. This game is very similar to the original Super Mario Bros. and the idea that it is a 2D platform side-scroller puzzle game where the player must avoid objects that could potentially threaten their life or something that might cause them to fall off of their floating platforms into the abyss and kill them. The difference here is the theme, and that the colors are the things destroying you and not monsters. And the ultimate goal is to become the multicolored player, where you are allowed to free roam your platforms without the worry of being destroyed by them. The possibilities of this game are potentially endless. The game will start very simple, where the player jumps across platforms of the same color, clearing the gaps to get to the door on the other side where they will progress to the next level. As the player progresses through the game, each level will get progressively harder, adding new mechanics or possibly new feats to conquer. There will be several different colors that the player can change between, covering the spectrum of the rainbow. The player can also move left and right on the side scroller so that if they feel they made a mistake, they can slightly backtrack to try to cover some grounds that they might have missed or might be potential to beating the level. However, once a player has picked up a collectible that changes the color of the player, that collectible is gone and cannot be grabbed again to change the player's colors back. So the player can only backtrack as far as the level allows per the color scheme. Different mechanics will be added to the game as the player progresses, such as moving platforms and traps that are set out to potentially destroy the player. At the end of the game, the player will also have increased potential by allowing the multicolored player to speed run through the entire game to try to beat their best time. This allows multiple playability throughout the game. The major risk involved in making this idea is creating something that is unbreakable especially by allowing something that is multicolored and will allow the player to replay the game later on where they will not be destroyed. 